Hello everybody. Welcome to my channel. Uh, hit the like button if you like, and if you don't, that's okay too. Uh, hit subscribe and uh, share. Now, I'm going back to uh, Trump's <clears throat> file that he filed, I should say, uh, for his executive privilege. Now, I said on the last video, uh, Biden had, um, uh, what do I want to say, not went with that. Yeah, he, Biden put the kibosh to it, in other words. But Biden has approved that he gets a chance to look over all the documents of the investigation and to view them. Mm -hmm. Well, nosy, ain't he? <laughs> oh, well. Okay. And uh, Trump is uh, requested a special master to go over the uh, money documents as he can to find fault and reasons why these documents was raided by the FBI and taken from his home and where are the mistakes that fell under the court that Trump has committed? The ones Trump endorsed won the primaries last night, even with a few Democrats. That sounds good. Congratulations to the college students and their forgiveness loans. I remember those that got their college education and graduated, they still couldn't find work. And now those that uh, got a grant so they wouldn't have to pay it back fell in the same root. Now this time in their lives and may not have a job as they went to college for in the first place. They may not have a job what they went to college for, what they studied for for two years, four years, whatever, you know, they couldn't get a job what they went to college for. No, oh, they had to get a job just like a common man, a common worker. Gosh, so they're still living in a mountain, I call it mountain poor, which it is, trying to pay off them loans. My goodness, well, I pray these... These loans will help some. Yes. I'm praying. Oh, this is devastating. Nine million people are still underwater of the states that have flooded. Prayers go out to those people. They are working so hard to save lives and the pilots are saving the pets that have survived to find them a new home if their owners can't come and get them. My goodness. China, with the cartel, is working to poison American children. Please, oh, please be careful. That I didn't like to read. I didn't finish it. But, you know, <laughs> anything is possible these days protect your babies protect your babies McConnell is opposing Trump's endorsement figures why wouldn't he you know oh my goodness will someone get some sense brain sense in Congress they complain about crime in this country I think that includes our government also, don't you? $300 billion added to the inflation. Mm. My goodness. Possibly more stimulus talk. Well, let's keep praying. Let's keep faith. Keep your hopes up. My goodness. Hmm. You wonder, don't you? You wonder, I make all these notes. I can't read half of them from my writing when I'm when I copy them down, write them down, I should say. Uh, I use a printer, but my printer won't hook up to this 
uh, all-in-one HP computer that I bought. I haven't even had it a year. And it will not accept my Canon printer. And it's a combo. It prints, it scans, it's the works. But my computer, I've, I've worked for hours. I've contacted Canna, Canon and got no reply. I answered a website that said they could help me. They would send me the information that I needed to get it to go so I can use it. I haven't heard a word from them. That was three days ago. They said in 24 hours. What's three, four days? <laughs> 64 hours? <laughs> so I'm still sitting here just hoping and praying, I guess, for every little thing that might come along that's positive. Oh, I can't wait to get rid of all this negative stuff. You know, that brings you down. We read the headlines. We read the verses, the, the uh, uh, chapters of what are they doing. You watch the, the reels on on the computer of the announcements at the White House. I, I heard a couple of them, got halfway through it and left. I, I, I cut out. Newscasters and all this stuff, they're doing their best they can to give us a little bit of promise, a little bit of hope, and a little bit of faith. But it's just what it is. What will be, will be. Remember that song? Okay, say raw, say raw. Yeah, I remember that. I used to sing that as a child. Yes, loved it, loved it. Well, that is all for now. And again, thank you for coming to my channel. And I'm still working on trying to get the glare off my glasses, but I can't afford these white boards that call white boards or these uh, round lamps. I can't afford none of that stuff. So I'm working on it, but my desk, I have an office desk here that I bought to store all my little its and bits and this and that and whatever. And it, it's a beautiful desk and I got it very reasonably priced off a of finger hut. I hope I don't get in trouble for mentioning them. But um, you watch them because the interest will eat you up. You keep making pay uh, payments every month, but it doesn't seem to beat the interest. You know what, I get, what I'm getting at? Oh, but I, I'm doing it and doing it and doing it. But um, this desk is too heavy. And I watched one video that said, well, move yourself to stop the glare from your camera uh, to your video. I can't do, I can't lift this desk. <laughs> I can't lift nothing. I'm lucky to lift five pounds of potatoes, <laughs> really, you know, and I can't move this desk. So I can't move me. So I got to have some ideas here. How to get the glare off my glasses. I wondered if I took maybe um, cling wrap, saran wrap, and just cut the shape of my glasses and put it on the inside or on the outside of my glasses. Would that help? But then you probably couldn't see my eyes, could you? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I just keep putzing along. That's what I do. God bless everybody. Thank you again for stopping by. <laughs> like if you like. If you don't, that's okay too. Just as long as you listen for a while. You know, maybe you found something exciting or something hilarious coming from an old woman. <laughs> you never know. <laughs> Share if you like. I love you all. God bless. Stay safe and keep the faith. Amen. Bye.